Welcome back to Space Engineers, folks. I have been working a bit on the boogie here, or the rover, or whatever you want to call it. Let me know what you think it should be called. And also let me know what you think uh, of the design so far. It's, uh, it looks a little bit weird right now, but uh, it's in the early stages, right? Uh, I did move the front wheels down one notch, because I thought it looked a little bit weird that they were up so high, so now they're kind of in the middle of of the big 5x5 uh, five five wheels, so the 3x3s three are in the middle. I think that looks a bit better. Uh, I changed up the batteries a bit. Uh, they are they were horizontal before, now they're vertical, because that allows us to fit in some cargo containers down the middle, which I kind of like. Now, the next thing I want to get on here is a shield emitter. So for that we need a shield controller, uh, which will stick on here. Shield controller front, shield controller rear. We'll stick that on there. And then there's the shield emitter. Must be in the open to function and have a control block to work. So it has a control block now. Uh, then we need to stick it somewhere where it will be in the open. Which I honestly don't know where we'll be now. Just yet. So we'll wait a bit with that. I think let's try and, and do the front here and see how we can get that to look. So... What we'll do... really hard to see these slopes sometimes. Like that. And... Hmm. Oops. I think I do want the slopes here as well. Slopes here. Okay. And here, we want the light armor inverted corner like that. And over here, we want it like that. I just want a corner. Like that. And like that. Which means that this block actually needs to be an inverted corner. Corners here. Which means that, that needs to be an inverted corner as well. Oops. Light armor corner. Man, it's dark in here. I should put up some lights, really, shouldn't I? Okay. 
Oh, well, let's... Why do I have lights? There. Looks like okay, that looks fine. We'll do lights here and on the other side of this. And here. Just so we can see what's going on. Helps a bit on the lighting anyway. Where were the lights? There. Three. Where do we have them? There. No, not there. God damn it. better. How many did we stick in? One, two, three, four, five. It's a total of 20. Control panel, light. How many lights do we have? 37. take these guys and these guys and just those guys it's a radius we'll call it a garage Lights. Save. Alright, that's much better. Let's see what's going on. Okay. Back at it. Okay, I guess the front there looks a little bit weird. Hmm. 
I don't know about that. Let me know what you think of that front. It looks a little bit weird to me. It looks a little bit weird to me. Suppose we could stick... ...the shield in here. Or on this. I don't know. Okay. Um. Hmm. It looks a little weird. Weird. Looks a little weird. Uh, okay, so down underneath here, uh, we do, I think I do want some gyros on here. And I think, just take a couple of gyros in there. else I want. I have considered sticking some uh, atmospheric thrusters in here to vertical to, to allow us to fly as well, but it's a boogie, it's not a it's not a it's not really a, a flying thing. It's not supposed to be a flying thing. So, if we do light armor slope here, we'll do it up here as well. Same on the other side. Can we put rock things on this? I don't think so. Yeah. There's a rocket. It is. Just try sticking that there. Go on here, it will. That might actually not be bad. Hmm. Having one on each side, that could be interesting. Two on each side. Yeah, I think that could be interesting. If we hmm. stick one there. 
Nothing else that'll look cool. that we can do like a corner here. A corner here. Okay. Think that'll look okay. And I do want some rocket turrets up here. Or not rocket turrets, just normal turrets. Gatling turret going. What am I missing for that? Little grids. Again. And then what I'd like to do is elevate it. At it and have another one behind it. What are we missing for this metal grids? Let's just start some metal grids building, shall we? Production, uh, assembler, metal grids. Um, there. We 
have fuel. Don't actually need to close the door, but I'll do it anyway. And I like the look of those uh, rockets as well. I think that it looks pretty sweet. This won't all be this gray blackish color. I'll we'll make some of it another color. Okay, so if we A survival kit on here, and I want a hydrogen tank and an oxygen tank. So let's see how we can fit that. Oxygen tank. Oh, but we can't really do that. We can't really do that. We can't really do that. Because I need a connector on here as well. So first we need a a U. Two of you. And then hydrogen tank will actually fit like that. need an H2O2 generator as well. So I don't have... I can go there. Then we need 
need those small hydrogen tanks. Now they have small ones in one side there. So if we fit them, that's not going to work. I could fit them there. Almost balance it. What am I missing? I'm missing I have the HO2 generator, I have the hydrogen tank, I have the oxygen tank. I'm missing a survival kit. case I'd have to build it up here which build it there it might actually be okay uh, no no Damn it. those two connection points, yeah. Crap. So if we stick it... That. Then we can stick a Gatling turret on top. And then we just... Oh, that's not centered, is it? No. Centered. Then we just need this to come together somehow. And to get the shield on. Oh, and the connector. I have a connector here somewhere. Connector needs to come back a little bit. I don't know about that. Uh, hmm. We'll see. We'll see. But it basically has everything that we need now, including pretty good firepower. So yeah. 
Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. I would love to hear your thoughts. But uh, we are out of time, so thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.